Hello from southwestern Germany and welcome to the city by the Neckar. We're at the Mercedes-Benz Arena for this one. I'm Derek Ray and adjacent to me in the commentary box is Stuart Robson. And we have live action from the Bundesliga coming right up. It is Stuttgart facing Eintracht Frankfurt. Well, thanks Derek as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. And so the Stuttgart starting 11. Well, the player that needs to affect the game is the one at the top of the midfield, Diamond. If he can get on the ball and dictate the play, they should control this match. And the starting 11 for Eintracht Frankfurt. Well, it looks like they're using the same formation. So it's all about winning the individual battles. And there's some really good matchups out there today. And so the match is underway. Good technique displayed. And let's give credit to the defending. That's a good looking ball in behind. He might be able to make it through. An early goal. It is the ideal opening. Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. And back underway. 1-0 it is. Now the referee not too happy with the challenge and blows for a free kick. Into the box it goes. Well, still an issue here. And I think the threat has been averted. Room to manoeuvre on the wing. And a harmless cross, gobbled up. Now, high quality defending. Applying vigorous pressure. On well, space for them here. And a useful cross. A decisive clearance it was. Very timely interception. Daichi Kamada. There's a slide draw pass. Bore. Well, that's how to put in a clean tackle. Well, 
Well, he made that interception look routine. In truth, it wasn't. Bonna Sosa. And he could really get at the opposition. But they took care of the situation defensively. Just not looking confident in possession. In a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. Couldn't be comfortable in bringing that ball down. Routine, really. Wataru Endo. Well, great read there to intercept. So, oh, great vision. And a fine cross. And the danger still on. And in the end, no damage done. And he's won the ball. Gibril So Daichi Kamada Kostic has it couldn't keep it oh, showing excellent vision can he finish and that's an excellent piece of defending to thwart him a chance then for the respective managers to address their charges it is half-time here. This man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Stuart. Well, it was certainly a good first 45 minutes for the lad. Obviously, he got his goal to put them in front, but he's looked lively throughout too. Hopefully, we see more of him in the second half. As anticipated, plenty of talking points so far. And now the second half is underway. Now, what can they produce on the flank? Useful cross towards the near post. Not messing around with that clearance. He's taken on his opponent here. And the referee says corner kick. Who's going to get on the end of it? A deft clearance. Looking confident with the ball at his feet. And a good-looking ball. And a disappointing effort, making the keeper's life a bit too easy. High-quality defending. And a good-looking ball. Oh, a great chance it was. Goalkeeper has it. Well, what a good piece of goalkeeping that was. But the equaliser can't be long in coming, surely. Might be a chance here. Terrific save. Trying to pick out a teammate. Well, he'd love to have that header back. In fairness, he was being closely watched. And into the last 30 minutes now. And potential danger. And putting his body on the line. Well, here it is again, and that's the perfect volley, isn't it? He strikes it so well. What an excellent finish. Oh. 
so 2-0 now. So, what can they do from here? Firing it in and throwing himself up the ball. Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. And there's the delivery. Clattered away. Kamada laid into the box. Well clattered away. And into the last 20 minutes. And it's offside. That was very close. Well, as you can see, the hosts have had most of the ball and they've made good use of it. They really have played some good attacking football and they look like scoring more. And beyond the last defender, offside. And time for the change now. Seemed to switch off for a moment, and now a throw in. Silas. Well, they might be onto something. Able to close down the shot. Now the delivery. The clearance wasn't decisive. And a time for cool heads. Chandler. Well, on the cusp of the final whistle, and the home side really prospering today. Stuart, interested to get your take. And now it is there for him. Not finished yet. Not quite yet. Still excitement left in the game. Well, here it is again, and credit to the goal scorer, but you have to ask questions of the keeper. He's got to have that near post covered for me. No wonder he's frustrated with himself. And the ball is moving again. Anyone's guess how this is going to finish? 2-1 currently. Well, just listen to the noise in here. These fans are doing everything to get their team over the finish line. And there's not long left now. Not a great pass. How can they turn one of these attacks into a goal? Space and time for the cross. No-nonsense clearance. Now can they counter clinically? They need to get bodies back. Determined defending. Oh, moving it nicely. Can he convert? Time is not on the side. This corner could help the prospects as they look for an equaliser. And time for the change now. He's driven in the corner. The referee blows for full time. It ends at a victory for the home team. No complaints from the fans here.
well, Derek. They didn't dominate the game by any means today, but overall they had the better of the chances and just about deserved their win. But it just seems in this game he's been a step ahead of his opponents in every way, Stuart. Well, it's a good performance. He worked hard, played well and scored a goal. And his team won. What more could you ask for?